Hi everybody, it's Amanda Burbage from the Faculty Professional Development Team and I'd like to show you how easy it is to access the Faculty Professional Development Committee Google Drive. The first thing you'll want to do is go to My TCC and then log in with your VCCS user credentials or your Blackboard credentials. After you've signed in, you'll see all of the various services that the VCCS and TCC provide, and the second icon is Gmail. By clicking that button, the computer will open up to your VCCS email account. Now, if you've never opened that before, you may have to press the Continue button. And you should make an appointment with a Faculty Professional Development Manager because you're missing out on a lot of great tools. So if you're ready to find the Google Drive, go to the top right corner of your screen and click this icon that I call the waffle because it's got the nine squares stacked. And when you click it, a drop down menu appears and you're going to want to select the icon called Drive. Now these icons display in various orders, so yours may not be in the center of the drop down box. Nonetheless, you are looking for the icon called Drive. And this is your Google Drive, kind of like your cloud, where you can save information, files, images for use and access at any point. Click on the left link, Shared With Me, and you'll see anything that someone has shared with you uh, to your address. And you're looking for a folder, which is indicated by this folder icon, called the Faculty Professional Development Committee. Double click on that and you now have accessed the shared Google Drive for the Faculty Professional Development Committee. I'd like to draw your attention back up to the right corner of your screen because I want to show you one handy tool. If yours is showing up like this where you see folder icons, um, this may be uh, visually appealing but sometimes it's problematic because you'll see that the title of the folder uh, runs off the icon size. Uh, you can hover your mouse over it to see the entire title or you can click the list view again in that top right versus the grid view and it'll display in a different way. Now specifically if you're looking for faculty development day information you can click on that folder and double click again. Here are all of the proposals that we've received um, as of today for faculty professional development day uh, 2016. In order to review a proposal double click on the file and it opens up in your screen. Here you can see the name of the person who's made the proposal, the title, as well as the description. This person is also suggesting that uh, she would be willing to uh, present at a uh, conference showcase as well. And when you're done with the file, use this X in the top right corner. Um, if you mistakenly use the red X, then the whole thing goes away. So use the black X in, this, in the close and go to the next file. All right, I hope you can see how easy it is to access your Faculty Professional Development Committee folder. If you have any questions, don't hesitate to get in touch with a Batten Center manager.